Hello family, friends, and lovers. Uh, welcome to my channel. This is Show Love. Uh, this is the Show Love Tarot. Thank you for joining me again and again and again and again. I love you for it. I really do. Um, I have been guided to do a week ahead reading. This is the week ahead. Okay, a uh, collective week ahead. I pre-pulled the cards, uh, pulled from the major arcanas, and then I uh, clarify with the minors. Um, I used two decks in this reading. I was guided to use a couple of decks, so um, to confirm the message, to clarify the message for someone. Um, Again, thank you for joining. Please uh, like and subscribe to the channel if you feel so inclined. It helps that energy exchange, the spiritual exchange of energy. Okay, so um, that helps you and me. A simple like and a simple subscribe. It don't hurt nobody, but it helps everybody. Okay, so um, let's get started here. So the first card, again, I you know pull the uh, major arcanas and then uh, clarify with the minors. Uh, the first card that came out is the Temperance card. This is a card of balance. This is a card of patience. This is a card of um, this is temperance, <laughs> uh, patience, balance. Uh, equaling out uh, so some of you may have been patiently waiting about a, a situation or outcome in a situation some of you have been patiently waiting um, some of you have been um, seeking balance in the situation and patiently waiting for that balance to come in that situation and uh, maybe kind of in a way um, have some of this is a message for some of you some of you have done all you can in this situation and now you just have to be patient and wait um that's the first card that came out it was a temperance and um let's see here this is catching my eye temperance card you know you may have had some obstacles to overcome but you have been waiting for some obstacles to be removed for you to be able to move forward and the next card that came out the next um major arcana card that came out is the high priestess uh many of you have had to go within uh some of you haven't haven't have been seeking um higher counsel um about the situation some of you have been using your intuition about the situation some of you have had to go within and seek higher truth this situation looks like it's caused many of you um an opportunity for spiritual growth and um a retrieve with uh, a, a reason to go within <clears throat> and seek the truth within but uh, for the most part, a lot of you are um, seeking a higher truth, a higher meaning. You may be seeking counseling. Maybe it's a, um, whether it's a therapist, uh, legal counsel. Um, you get the idea. Uh, for this thing that you've been patiently waiting for, you have um, haven't been able to, uh, or you have been seeking. Um, some higher information some higher truths about the situation with this high priestess card here so the next card that came out the next card is of the major arcana is the um star in reverse uh star in reverse this may be for some <laughs> this you know the sense of hopelessness so, um, a few of you have been feeling hopeless in this situation. You know, maybe you have struggled to find the right communication, to find the right words, to find the right counsel. It's been a struggle and, you, you know, some of you are, are you know, kind of giving up. 
and uh, um, seeing this situation as hopeless. Right? Sorry, some cards fell to the ground. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So, yeah. Um, this is a card of hopelessness. Um, you know, not seeing a way out of the situation. Um, not uh, not seeing that there is, is a way out of this situation. With the start and the reverse. Um, you've been patient. You've been seeking help. But still, it feels like that, you know, you're, um, uh, you know, all is lost. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and the card on the bottom of the deck that clarified that is the justice in reverse. So uh, some of you feel like the situation, whatever it is, it may be a legal situation. It may be a, a situation dealing with some type of higher authority that you're feeling that you're not... Um, getting any justice in right and there's some injustice um in what area of your life that you're feeling this there's an injustice that you're feeling hopeless um so those are the major arcanas but the the um you know maybe it's in a partnership maybe it's in a position that you feel like you had or you had um but that is all coming to an end this hopelessness this feeling of hopelessness is coming to an end, okay? Um, so don't worry about it. Don't worry. Be happy. That might be the let me <laughs> that might be the title of this uh reading. Don't worry, be happy. Uh trust and have faith. <clears throat> so the minor card that uh came out to clarify the temperance was the um knight of wands this is slow and steady slow and steady movement slow and steady wins the race right uh slow and steady and uh, because you have been patient this this clarified the temperance card because you have been patient you've been patiently waiting you've been seeking higher truth and higher uh authorities and and going in and seeking the truth within yourself it's that, that consistency, there's some movement happening, finally getting some movement, and the card that clarified, <laughs> the card that clarified the high priestess is, is the king of wands. So that truth has come out, look, the smoke is clear. After all, the smoke is clear, you know, you've been patiently waiting for that smoke to clear, and it's clear, and the truth is coming out. Oh, <laughs> this card is like jumpy. Oh my goodness, <laughs> it's a lot of the truth. The truth will set you free, I swear to God. Look at that. <laughs> truth will set you free. And it's coming out, whether you want it, whether you want to or not. There have been some people who haven't wanted this secret to come out, this truth to come out. They've been trying to keep it at bay. Um... <clears throat> And whoever you are, you've been patiently waiting for the right time for this to come out. You've been patiently waiting for the uh, long arm of justice. My uncle, uh, God rest his soul, my uncle Gene used to always say, you can't run from justice. And you can't. Mm-mm. 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 You can try. <laughs> Mm-mm. And Monica Jean used to always say, say what you mean to me to say. If you're scared, say you're scared. If you're scared to move forward, but do it anyway. Do it anyway. Some of you may have been, you know, uh, waiting to take an action <clears throat> that you should have taken against uh, some truth um, or some um, injustice. Some of you have been waiting to speak about an injustice. But the time is now. Speak about it. Talk about it. Be about it. Okay, the truth is coming out. The truth about this. Uh, whatever you've been waiting for. Whatever this injustice that has happened to you or someone around you in your, in your environment. Um, the week ahead. <laughs> uh, all of that's coming out. All of that's coming out. 
Mm-hmm. Yep. The truth is coming out. The situation that you felt, um, you or someone you know, someone around you that felt uh, like it was hopeless, <clears throat> uh, was clarified by the Ten of Pentacles. It may have something to do with a, a job, a business, a family uh, situation, property, uh, this property situation. You may, <laughs> you may start seeing like it's hopeless. But the truth is coming out that, you know, the truth is coming out about it. It's not hopeless at all. You will have victory. You will have this, uh, you will have justice. The card that was on the bottom of the deck um, in the minors was the five of swords. So the people, the people, places, things, times, and events, I thought they were going to get, get away with this injustice. It's not going to happen. They're going to be defeated. This is a card of defeat. They will not be able to move to calmer waters. Um, but this Queen of Pentacles, this Queen of Pentacles, someone saw this coming. This Queen right here, she just, you know, maybe you're the Queen that, maybe this is the Queen of Pentacles that was patiently waiting for this, this uh, injustice to take place with this in, in regards to money or property or uh, employment. Maybe um, someone was uh, wrongfully terminated, perhaps. But whatever it is, whatever this Ten of Pentacles situation is, this Queen of this Queen of Pentacles saw it coming, and she tried, you know, <clears throat> she tried to warn them, and they tried to uh, withhold the truth. Someone in the situation tried to withhold the truth. Someone in the situation tried to withhold money. Someone this in the situation tried to withhold property, but that's not going to happen. They're not going to see it through. It's not going to be seen through. Whoever this money and property belongs to, it's going to be, they're going to have victory. Whatever the situation is, you've been patiently waiting. This person's been patiently waiting. They've been seeking higher truth and higher counsel in a situation that they seemed that was hopeful, uh, uh, hopeless, and they were seeking injustice, and they're going to have victory. No doubt about it. Six of Pentacles, equal give and take. The gifts and money that was uh, 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 meant for you, you're going to have it. Whoever this is, you're going to have a new beginning. You're going to get this quickly. And the people who try to block this, they're going to be really disappointed. They're going to be crying over spilt milk. Spilt, spilt, spilt milk. <laughs> I don't even like milk, honestly. Who drinks milk? <laughs> My best friend drinks milk. Gallons of it. I can't even. I can't even. <laughs> like every time he brings home a gallon, I'm like, oh. How? He would probably <laughs> he would probably cry over but not me. <laughs> These people who tried to block this uh, this new beginning, this this uh, money, this opportunity, this job, in this hopeless situation, uh, they're about to they're about to be crying over spilt milk. And uh, whoever this is that's been patiently waiting for this payout, for this uh, for this hope hopeless situation to be rectified, they're about to have a celebration. Three of Cups. Mm-hmm. About to have a celebration. And those who thought that they were clear, uh, free and clear, are um, are going to suffer a loss. Yep. No one's going to see this coming. This heavy burden is going to be dropped. Oh, oh my goodness. So, um, I'm going to wind this reading down. But I do want to, um, the cars that fell out earlier, I do want to acknowledge them because they want to be seen and heard. <laughs> Obviously. Um, we have the four cuts in reverse. This information, this money, this situation is about to be released. And whoever has been waiting patiently for justice to be served is about to receive it. Balance, temperance again. Uh, temperance again. 
this may be a Sagittarius, this may be a fire sign. Um, but this is definitely um, a situation that seemed hopeless coming in, into balance. And the judgment card came out. So um, a situation that seemed, you know, like it was over, it's being resurrected. Uh, judgment is being placed on the situation and um, everything is be being restored to its rightful owner. This Empress, this Empress is about to be uh, placed in her right, put yourself where you go. This could be an Empress or Emperor. Um, we're not really gender specific over here. You know, put yourself where you go. If you're Emperor, and you have been waiting on this situation to, to be to, for justice in a situation, you're about to get it. If you're Empress and you've been waiting for justice to be had in a hopeless situation, you're about to get it. <clears throat> this is your week ahead. Okay. Um, <clears throat> there's an offer coming. There might be an offer, an apology for blocking and delaying. Someone's going to be like, oh, <laughs> you know, my bad. <laughs> my bad, my ass. <laughs> straight to jail <laughs> whoever's been blocking you're good straight to jail <laughs> we don't take policies over here you block my good straight to jail that's <laughs> the hierophant card <laughs> fell out the hierophant ah uh, this is uh uh, divine intervention. This is uh, ancestry. This is a uh, higher communication that's coming in to speak the truth about this situation. This is the key. Look at that key. Uh, this may be uh, this is some doors opening, some uh, doors that were closed are opening. Maybe this property that you were locked out of, you're going to get the key back to. Mm hmm. This may happen in five days, five weeks, five months, or the fifth month of the year, wherever you put yourself. And the last card that came out was the justice card. So there, justice will be had. This is confirming. Justice what you think. Someone thinks that there's no hope, but there is. Like my uncle Eugene Morrison said, I was a kid. <laughs> he taught me this straight up. You cannot run from justice. Don't even try. I don't care. In, in, in any realm. In any dimension. Spiritual, physical, 5D, 3D, 2D, 4D, 6D. I don't care where you are. You cannot run from justice. The long arm. It may take a long time for that justice to come. But guess what? <laughs> it's going to come, my friend. I swear to God. It's going to come. So, I don't know who that is for. If you're the person who has been, you know, thin line between right and wrong. If you've been devil, if you've been... You know, walking a thin line between right and wrong in regards to someone else's money or property or whatever. Your time is up. Your time is up. Look at that. Your time is up. Ten of swords. Somebody's been watching you. Somebody's been reviewing your work. And you ain't gonna go nowhere. Mm-mm. Truth is coming out hot. Mm-hmm. Ooh-wee. Y'all keep y'all's nose clean. Okay? Don't mess with people's money. And My daddy told me once, he was like, this is things you don't mess with. You don't mess with people's emotions. You don't mess with their money. <laughs> Period. Dot. Okay? So whoever's out there messing with people's emotions and money, you are... There's no, uh, there's no good ending for you. There's going to be justice in this situation. So put yourself where you go and it's coming. It's coming. 
they're not going to get away with it. There's no, there's no calmer waters <laughs> for these people. Um, and uh, I hope that helps someone. Until next time, take care of family, friends, and lovers.